Okay, let's think about ways of using the program. First of all, you'd assume that if you're using this in the classroom, you'd be running it through a data projector and projecting it up onto the front of the classroom, in which case you would use it as an instructional tool. For example, if I was doing a circumference exercise, I might draw a circle, and while I was standing in front of the class and explaining these principles, I'd be drawing things on the canvas and using that as my explanation. Okay, there's another way to use the software, and that is to set an exercise up before class. For example, I might set this exercise up before class. I might ask the students to measure, to measure this uh, radius here and the circumference. Now I can save this file. I'll click on Save As there, and I might save it onto the desktop. Okay, and I'll call it Exercise One. Okay, now I could then tra put that onto a shared drive for the students to access. And if the students in the computer lab actually had this on their computers, then they could open this file up and they could work on it as well. Okay, so basically two ways of using it. One as an instructional tool, and the second way of using it is to prepare a file for students to work with and have them open that file up and work with it in the classroom. Uh, if you're looking for some examples of files that have already been prepared, please have a look at the wiki site. There's plenty of examples there.